Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Nuclear Throne Ultra. We're jumping in again and this time I'm going to play as some little melting. Do you know what? I haven't played as melting as a, in a little bit. Let's do some melting. Melting's always, always a lot of fun, even if he is super, super tough. I really think he's quite fun. Uh, I probably shouldn't have gone in here straight away, especially with how difficult this area can be and not having a secondary weapon, but let's just pretend that's not what happened and um, I... Uh, I made the right decision, and everything's going to be A-okay. It's going to be A-okay. Now, something I did want to ask... Okay, I'm dead. Something I did want to ask is, um... Obviously, Nuclear Throne does pretty well on my channel. People seem to like Nuclear Throne quite a lot. So, would people want to see more Nuclear Throne? Um, like, I try to do it twice a week whenever I can, and I'm, I'm hoping that I can stick to that. Uh, but potentially, I could I could do some more Nuclear Throne, sort of. Not, not like a guaranteed daily episode or anything like Isaac is, but like a little bit of extra episodes thrown in here and there when I get the opportunity to record more, because it seems like people really do enjoy it. Um, let's go with Tough Shell. Tough Shell for the plus one HP is pretty good stuff. I like that. I like this as well. I would like to get a thrown but here to... Uh, Make our thingy. Stop moving backwards, you stupid scorpion. Fuck's sake. <laughs> I kept encroaching on him. You kept moving back further and further. Ah, you bastard. But see, there you go. He survived a hit. Did this guy die on my god. There you go. We've got two bouncy weapons now, so shotgun shoulders would be pretty fun to uh, incorporate here. We'll see if we can find it. There it is. There it is. I think Shotgun Shoulders is just a, a really, really fun time anyways. Especially with something like this that has like the sort of split multi-shot kind of thing going on. I just fought you, fella. You see how much more damage that ended up doing? We've also got this thing, which is bouncy as all hell as well. We like it. My god. Good floor. Good floor. Um, right. I could stay, take Ecstatic Fists, and I think I will, because I'm always going to have that burn. Basically, I'm always going to be on full health, or pretty much always. So, um... It makes all the sense to gain that bonus damage all the time. And it's quite a lot of bonus damage as well. 35% is pretty wicked. Who is left? Again, nice and easy floor there. Blood bullet shotgun. Sounds pretty good, but I'm sticking with the bouncies right now. I'm happy with the bouncies. Um, take plutonium hunger here. I like the new visual on Plutonium Hunger. A little zoomy visual. I think we can carry this on pretty well with just shotguns here, and we could pick up some more shotguns later. I did unfortunately get hit there. I always hate that when they like fire like a sly little shot in. But this is why I took Plutonium Hunger, because I can survive a shot now, and then health comes in pretty easy to us when uh, it's available. Director Slugger. That would bounce, but it doesn't split into any extra shots, so I don't think it'd be that valuable for us, really. As much as it is good. Yeah, I'm liking this a lot. I'm liking this a lot. This is a, a fun run, and we can potentially get some insane stuff going on with Melting. I can't even remember if I've seen Melting's new Ultras. Oh, by the way, something I really need to do. I got a message off of someone a little while ago. Uh, let me see if I can bring up. Unfortunately, mm, Discord streamer mode. I, d I hate this bullshit. For some reason, Discord has this streamer mode thing where it won't show me anyone's goddamn name in Discord um, because I'm live. Oh, is, is the video gone off while I'm tabbed out? I'm sorry. Basically, uh, your screen's black right now, but they sent me a bunch of different ways of um, unlocking the alternate ultras, which is really, really nice. So we can kind of go for some of them. Um, I'll have a little look through to see if we've got 
this one here. D melting is have one HP when you level ultra. So we get an extra ultra choice if we have one HP when we level ultra. Which I don't really know what the best way to do that is, to be honest. There's definitely probably ways to do it, but not that I'm privy to. Nice, okay. Keep making our way back. I see you over there, but I don't care for you. Um, extra accuracy could be nice. Alkaline saliva is uh, pretty goddamn good, so I can survive the first hit each floor. Take no damage on a hit the first hit, should I say, at least. Yeah, that one's going to be kind of hard to get. I don't like you sitting behind the uh, the skull there. That's a little cheeky. Yeah, this is not good. I've put myself in bad positions here. It's because of all the fucking snipers, man. The snipers everywhere. Luckily, Alkaline Saliva kind of saved me there. That was that was pretty sketchy. Th this weapon with shotgun shoulders is honestly so fucking good, man. <laughs> Barely even need anything else. Unfortunately, I could still die here. Okay, now I got some HP, luckily. Got ourselves flat cannon there. Is flat cannon... Okay, flat cannon's probably pretty good for us here. Yeah, let's take that. I liketh the flat cannon. We're leveling up really fast as well here. Um, we'll definitely take that, thank you, for the extra damage. This is going to be a pretty sketchy floor overall. I don't like the summoning boys that are about. What we got going on here? Bouncer Plasma Gun is, is pretty amazing as well. I could, could be, I could be convinced by this. Must certainly be convinced by this. Yeah, that does quite a bit of damage. I like that. That's good for bossing. And the flat cannon here can take care of other stuff for us. Just because like, normally flat cannon's not all that amazing. Because obviously it hits, but then a bunch of the shots don't hit. But now, with this setup, all the extra shots go bouncing around and hit loads of stuff. So it works out pretty well. And it just, like, bounces around the room doing shitloads of damage. I like it. I like it a lot. Heavy blood rifle. Nope. I'm still sticking with what I've got here. I will most certainly blow up that car. Thank you. Got to be careful of certain enemy types here. Keep my distance. Remember, we always get the first hit free each floor. No! My bad. That was a very fun first run. I'll be honest. That was a very fun first run. Was that first run? Maybe it was second. I feel like it was first. Good. Got level two there. You see how that I use the blood explosion then to destroy that shot just in the nick of time? That's what you call pro right there. Scarier face again. Ah, yeah. I could, do you know? <laughs> get get there on one HP. Glass cannon. Uh, glass arm cannon would be the way to do that. And then I can only ever be at one HP. That, that, that solves our problem really, doesn't it? There's no way I can't get there at one HP if I only have one HP. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. That was a, a, a rogue shot that I was not ready for there. Why does... Do you know, sometimes this game's so unfair. Like, why does it put the burn skull literally the other side of the entire map? How am I ever meant to make it there in time? It's closed up before I'm even close to it. Got a jaw splitter here. Nice. 
Honestly, I think tough, tough skin or whatever it's called, the one that gives us plus one HP and the uh, lower damage, is kind of a necessity for this guy. But that's why I'm going to take this. <laughs> Beautiful stuff. Anything else on this floor? Get off me. That there is. Didn't want to miss out on that sweet deal. Um, for here, I guess. There's not really much that works well for us here, so... I guess I'll take the lower, uh, lower bullet speed. That could help. Kind of helped right there, actually. That over there. Can you give me? Can you? Can you bugger off? Level four already. Love that. I like to play risky. And this is as risky as it gets. One HP and a dream. <laughs> Ecstatic fists would be kind of good here. I'm gonna take bolt marrow though, because because of the weapon that we currently got. I feel like it makes sense. If you take damage, it's all over. The one hit wonder. Don't like having those mines around. Especially don't like having the fucking boss around, my god. He's definitely gonna jump on me and fucking insta-kill me, isn't he? There's a triple pop gun? Oh my god. I was just gonna say, how is he not fucking dead? Triple pop gun's insane. <laughs> Didn't even know that existed. Okay. We are through, um, and I guess at this point we do go for the fists. I, I really don't like being on this stage, I'll be honest. This is, uh, not the stage we want to be on. I always forget the water leads here. Oh, I forgot those guys have changed. They fire a shot when they die now. I completely forgot they did that. They never used to do that, and in a recent patch they got updated, so now they fire a, a shot whenever they die, and it's... It's made things harder. Certainly made things harder. Hmm, ah. man. Some of these shotgun shots aren't hitting and it's... It's really pissing me off. Oh, there we go. Um, throwing butt's always fun with this guy, but I still think our line saliva is just too good. Hand cannon's pretty goddamn good here, to be honest. Would hand cannon benefit from shotgun shoulders, maybe? Kind of looks like it. Wouldn't do an awful lot of damage, mind you, but it seems decent. The damage on it isn't great. <laughs> the damage on it isn't great. Um, let's take eagle eyes here with the shotgun. I don't think that's a bad idea. Getting a more focused shot off of four oh, oh, say. Oh wait, dude. Are you actually kidding me? This entire time, this entire time we've been playing with the pistol. I just thought we only had the pistol unlocked. No, it turns out we have golden weapons, and we just randomized the pistol a ton of times. Give me the pop rifle, you dick. <laughs> of course I want the pop rifle to begin with. Why would I not? <laughs> Don't be mean to me, game. How dare you give me the pistol three times in a row? But it would be nice to get some more golden weapons unlocked in this scenario. It would be nice to not fucking die. Oh, man. It happens quite a lot to me uh, that 
I, I feel like I die because, I mean, for one, I play bad. But I feel like I die because um, these, like, cactuses and the skulls and stuff like that just absorb bullets. They just eat all of your shots. I really need some stuff to recreate that first run, to be honest. Charged bow. Yes, please. Oh, come on now. Get out of there, you dick. Charged bow. We'll take metabolism. I'm, I'm trying not to take strong spirits to get the achievement unlock for that, but... Oh, I should have taken the tail thing for the extra charge speed on my burr. That would have been really good, actually. I honestly don't think it's plausible to do well without the um, the mutation that we got the first time around. The plus one health, minus one damage taken. But it's literally not shown up once since then. We got it once and then it went bye-bye. There it is. Tough shell. I think Tough Shell's like, not completely a necessity, but it's it's a very, very strong mutation for this guy. Now we're at max HP, we've got a much better chance of survival. Not quite enough to survive a fucking shotgun shot, though, obviously, you dick. Shotgun shot, you know what I mean, explosive shot. I just play, I play too aggressive as this guy, but you'll never stop me. You'll never stop me. I'll never not play this guy aggressively, because it's just fun. Um. Yeah. I'm always going to take shotgun shoulders if I have the weapons to uh, make it work. Fuck off, you cow. You absolute cow. I get something that I like and I, I, I express happiness about it and the game's like, nah, no. I shouldn't be expressing my happiness, apparently. Apparently that's risky in this business. I think it's... I think it's the unpredictability of some of the enemies. Like, it seems like some enemies will set a precedent of, oh, I I, I don't normally shoot. Like, I, I rarely shoot in this scenario. And every now and again, it'll be like, mm, but this time, this time's different. <laughs> Why? Dude, shotgun shoulders is like showing up so goddamn often right now. It's beautiful. Oh, you're not dead. There you go. It's the explosive buggers that are going to get me. These guys are fucking difficult, man. Yo, yo, gun. Beautiful. Really? I'm so close to a level up right now. Look at this. Throwing butt is, of course, good. Second stomach. Bouncy fat's potentially kind of good for us here. I'll try and get the achievement where I don't take uh, rhino skin or um, strong spirit. It does, it's, it's a little more hollow in uh, Ultra, because there is a bunch of other survival things you can use, but still, I still want to get it, regardless. Okay, well that's all that ammo gone. Boss, I was I'm not expecting you quite yet, and I'm a little annoyed that you decided to spawn. I'll be honest, I'm a little annoyed. Can we, can we die, please, bird? Birdman, can we fucking die, please? My god, how much health do you have, Birdman? Fucking die! <laughs> oh my god, how much health does that thing have? Ugh. Man, this 
game's so frustrating, but at the same time I love it. Oh man, I I wish the game was just standard, get you to level 2 at the first level. I get it's a roguelike, I get it's got to be somewhat random, but dude, sometimes... One at a time, they all come knocking at the door. Yeah, don't you be eating corpses, my lad. Y'all stop that right now. You got an inverted area. I was so excited for the inverted area. I love that inverted area. I was so excited for it and you ripped it away from me. I told you, I'm not allowed to get excited about things. If I do, I die. Stay completely neutral, show no emotion. Um, I actually think the impact risk could be pretty good here. Just because it spreads to the corpses around when we do the explosions. Um yeah, I like that. We're good. We're good. Ooh, blowing up one of those with blood means they don't actually put any toxins out. It's kind of nice to know. I think I need the uh, throne book to really make this work, though. His, uh, his little body explosion thing is actually kind of crap without throne book. It's actually amazing with it, but the discrepancy between the two is, is pretty large. There we go. Scarier face is always good for us here. Flint again. Eh, I'm kind of happy with what I've got going on right now. We good? We good. Ah, I always forget to take you to YBs. Now, I'm not particularly happy with this situation. I think I'm going to die here. <laughs> These are some really, really beefy enemies all kind of stuck down there. Oh, you've decided to fire off a ton of missiles as well. Oh my god, some of these enemies are so tanky, man. Oh, and a fucking course. Of course you give me fucking disc gun. Why wouldn't you? Oh my. Of course you give me disc gun. We do get to go to the inverted version of this area, which is kind of nice. Although I believe these missile guys are insane in the inverted area, so we've got to be really careful for them. Yes, they are. Don't you dare! Oh my god. Thank you. That's better. Yo yo gun. I like that. Golden yo yo is good with me. Alright, thou thrown, but. We definitely need a stronger weapon at this point. This thing is uh, waning, most certainly. It's sheepifying. It's still sheepifying, but. Could be doing better. Bob, 
Bomb launcher, does that do much for us? We've got an inverted area here. Okay, I can't believe we're still on a basic shotgun right now, I'll be honest. Um, but, time has come. Look at that big boy, he's just fucking walking at me at high speeds. Like, there's no care in the world, fucking stay back, heathen. Frost is rather nice here. Eraser's good. I think I'll take the Eraser over that. Even though I've just put a bunch of mutations on it, I still think the Eraser's going to be much, much better. It's going to be one of those turrets just hiding in the corner, isn't it? Yep. It always is. It always is in the stage. Tough shell. I, I always forget how difficult this, this boss is, but I, I remember it being more difficult than I assume. Okay. Worked out. Ooh, what is that? The broken stair gun. Oh my lord. That's fucking amazing. And we do have, um, what's it called as well? On this run, don't we? Do we? Boiling veins. We do. We do have boiling veins in this run. So, I'll take that. That seems, uh, seems pretty, pretty broken, as it, as the name suggests. We'll see if we get, get a chance to use it. Oh my god. <laughs> the ammo consumption of that thing is fucking nuts, but I love it. Ah, oh, this is, this is such death, this. It, I'm gonna have to take Rhino Skin here. I don't want to, but I don't want this run to die. Oh, okay, it did. It did. It did give me the eraser. I, I almost. I thought I lost the eraser for a hot second there, and I was pretty pissed off. One second. I can hear a noise. Turns out it's just my fucking washing machine going ape shit. Unfortunately, we don't have the ammo to fight this guy, really. Which I'm not happy about. This guy will annihilate us, given the opportunity. As you can clearly see, he's going to. I'm very annoyed I don't have enough ammo to fight this guy. Oh my god, but he's dead somehow. But he's dead somehow. This is, this is wild. This is wild. <laughs> what an absolutely wild weapon. Weapons insanity. Also, I like this thing with double explosive on it. That's, uh, it's pretty fun. You stay away from me, thank you. We got Ultra. Unfortunately, getting to 1 HP might not be the easiest here, but... That's the second time we've been offered Ion Cannon. Let's have a look, see what we've got going on here. Blowing, uh, blow up low HP enemies. Um, lose half your health, gain three more mutations. Oh, that's kind of tempting. Increase max level by one, even more rads. Half ammo cost for all weapons. All weapons cost a small amount of rads. Interesting. The type of enemy that dies last in an area is dead in the next, er next area. Oh, that's, that's pretty spicy. These are all good. Neat. Now this, does that just mean they blow up when they get to low HP? Or does that mean that I blow them up when they get to low HP? I'm going to try it and see. I'm going to try it and find out. 
So it might be I have to right click to, to detonate them at low HP, or it might just be that when they get to low HP, they automatically blow up. Right. I'd like it if I could get some of this ammo that you're throwing out, please. Nah. Dude, um, this is fucking insane. Can you chill out? Okay, he's dead. My god, my guy. That was ridiculous. Nice and easy. Okay, we made it. I like this. This is good shit. Shotgun shoulders just makes like even lower level shotguns amazing. God damn, this is this is just beautiful. Let's take a mutation, not mutation, a crown when we can. If we can. Energy lands would be pretty fun. That's just a normal old nuke launcher. I've got something that's a nuke launcher plus one. What the hell are you doing here, mum? I gotta wait for these things to reload because it takes quite quite some time. Get out of here, you. Okay, I'm running out of ammo. Oh, that was bad. There is some health over there, but. Getting to it's not gonna be easy. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm dead. That was a lot of fun either way. Hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.